everybody, this is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Today I want to talk a little bit about the length of grain of rice. We hear about long grain rice, short grain rice, what is the difference on all this and what type of rice is long grain rice and what type of rice is short grain or medium grain. Hopefully the information that I have here will help you out and clarify some questions that you might have. Long grain rice is the most common type of rice that we use. The grains are about four times longer than they are wide. They cook up being fluffy and the grains stay separated, firm and slightly dry texture. So long grain rice is good for side dishes and pilafs and salads as well. Types of long grain rice include the American long grain white rice that we typically see and so many people eat and long grain brown rice as well. Basmati rice and jasmine rice are also examples of long grain rice. So think of long grain rice as rice that does not stick together after it's been cooked. Medium grain rice, well that's about two to three times longer than it is wide, so it's not quite as long as the long grain rice. When it's cooked up, it's tender, moist, a little bit chewy, and the grains will tend to stick together some when they're cooked. Types of medium grain rice include aborio and Valencia rice, and those are good for risottos. And another medium grain rice is called bomba rice, and it's good for paella. Short grain rice that we don't see as much of in the store as we do the long grain varieties is short and plump and only slightly longer than it is wide. So it's, it's almost round, but not quite. It has a high starch content, which causes the grains to stick together and clump together after they've been cooked. It's often referred to as sticky rice or sweet rice, sometimes glutinous rice, although it's gluten-free, but glutinous rice is how we might call it. And it's actually very low in amylose and high in amylopectin, which is what gives it that sticky texture that it has. It's grown mostly in different regions of Asia. Common varieties of short grain rice include the American short grain brown rice and what we would call sushi rice. And of course, this type of rice is going to be best for sushi and molded salads that you want to stick together and also for puddings, especially rice pudding. I do hope this clarifies some information for you based on the type of uh, rice grains that are out there, the length of the grains. Let me know if you have any questions or comments. This is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Bye for now.